broken to burn the dawn day's voyage into silence and stay on to one of our good friends' ballots and by And today they're going to explain to me and to you what the Bagness effect is. Bagness effect. That's what I said, the yeah. Bagness effect. Yeah, that, that's, the, that's the Magnus effect. The effect caused by a spinning ball in a fluid such as air. Oh, yes. Right, now we've got some footage to show of my good friend Michael and Balax playing some tennis. So, roll the footage, people. Serve. Oh, underarm serve. Nice one. Burr. 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 Spin. Look at that. Spin. Burr. Look at it. Wow. Look at the spin. Oh, shit. That wasn't very good, was it? Oh, and it's hit the net. What an idiot. Welcome back. And I must apologize for the footage you just saw. By this voice, what he was doing, the noises you were making were just very idiotic, really. But anyway, I'm going to hand you over to these friends of mine to explain the Magnus effect. So here to it, the Magnus effect. As you can see, the ball is travelling to the right and the top spin is downwards. And this effect causes the air to flow faster under the bottom of the ball and the air to flow slower over the top of the ball. It basically, as the air is going faster underneath, that means there's less air in the same volume of space and more on the top. So as there's high pressure above and lower pressure below it, means the net pressure differential so the ball will go down the more top spin you put in the ball. And as you can see, this can be explained by the resultant force on the ball, which is equal to its weight plus the Magnus force. And so the acceleration downwards is G plus the Magnus force over the ball's mass. And this causes the ball to accelerate downwards more quickly. And therefore, the ball is more likely to drop in and so I mean, you just play better tennis altogether, don't oh, you? Oh, yes, yes, thank you for that, Alex and Michael. I understand that you put top spin on the ball, and it curves, curves the path of the ball, get it in more easily, like myself. I remember, I, I'm a very, um, very talented at top spin shots, but uh, that's, that's the story for another day. Anyway, thank you for that, Alex and Michael, and I uh, hope to see you next time in Byron McDonald's Voyage with the Science.